Hey everybody, this is Vic LaPlaca here with Marie Max Elm Ski in San Antonio, Texas. Today we're going to take a look at Harris's all new redesigned Grand Mariner 250. This pontoon is really one of a kind with its new redesigned lines. I mean, it is a bold looking pontoon. Up here in the front, you'll see that we have the um, LED rope lighting in there, kind of like running lights anytime you're out on the pontoon. You have your docking lights up in the front pop-up cleats we have the stainless steel rub rail insert we have the color match tower up on the top there with our JL tower speakers got your fuel fill here in the rear we go ahead and do the stainless steel safety railing so here it makes it perfectly legal for people to be riding around in the back lounger of this pontoon while you're out on the water we equipped this boat with the swim seat. That's a great feature when everybody's hanging out, you're tied up. You don't want to really be treading water using a mat. So you can go ahead and flip this down. Safety pin removed, fold it down. Then you got a swim seat here with a step to get up into the pontoon. Don't want to stand on it, it's just for sit sitting down. This boat is powered with a Mercury 350 Verado. I mean, this is some heavy horsepower we're talking about back here. This will get up any skier. It'll pull a tube. I mean, it'll do almost anything that you want. It really gets the boat up and going on top of the water. So we got our stainless steel telescoping ladder here. It's very robust. It's unlike some of the other manufacturers using that flimsy aluminum ladder. I mean, very sturdy. You can use it to board the boat while it's on the trailer. You see, we got our ski tow bar back here. Run the rope tie it up, keeps it out of the prop down there from the outboard. Back here we have our lounger. We got the uh, backlighting here with the Harris lettering around our uh, JL six and a half speakers. Over here on the far port side, we have our uh, onboard battery charger plug-in right there, making it very convenient to plug in your pontoon, whether it's in its slip or in a storage facility, making sure your battery is always 100% transom stereo remote from JL. So we have our lounger set up this way for people to face the rear of the boat, able to hang out. Now on our third position here, you remove this cushion up in the uh, cockpit here, get it out of the way, and this will lay all the way down, giving you a full flat pad. Now the cushions back here on the rear, they lock up into multiple positions. So whatever angle is more comfortable, you can go ahead and lock them in, more upright. You have plenty of storage down here. You'll see we have our uh, wood cockpit table down in there that is removable. You have your cooler bag from Harris, and then your 8.8 .8 fenders there with the quick release, making it very convenient when you're coming up to a dock. Push them all the way forward, and then they lay back down. Let's head on into the cockpit of the pontoon here. We'll take a couple, a couple looks at a couple different features. Battery switch will be located underneath this rear cushion there. You can access that same storage from the back through this compartment. You have your JL subwoofer, one out of two, located in this pontoon. Got LED cup holders throughout the pontoon. Plenty of USB plugs there to keep all those phones charged on a day out on the water. Got your backlighting behind the black panels there. Really cool look at night. Got your Bimini stainless steel frame there. Go ahead and if you just want shade here in the main cockpit of the boat, you can just have this Bimini set up. You got your forward Bimini that attaches to the front of the tower here. So if you want full shade from the front to the back of the pontoon, that's very nice to have on those hot Texas summer days. We got the fold down armrest from Harris. Plenty of storage underneath all the cushions here. Everything's on hinges. So no free floating cushions except that one that needs to be removed for the backrest to fold all the way down. So in here at the helm of the Harris Grand Mariner 250, uh, it's very luxurious feel to it. We got the high lux back seat here with the fold down armrest you got the swivel 
sliding forward and back um, seat base that's very convenient to have forward back and then of course you can swivel locks back in the forward position got a leather wrapped steering wheel from Harris here with the tilt this boat has the JL premium stereo in it so we got eight speakers throughout the cockpit of the boat and facing the back two subwoofers one that you saw earlier under the rear cushion here and then one under the side uh, flip up table there here at the helm we got the Simrad Go 9 dual Simrad screens they second as a uh, screen to watch your vitals chart plotter and sonar so you can have your chart and sonar set up on one, the vitals for your engine set up on the other. Um, the Media Master 105 from JL here controls the entire stereo system. You can control the zones of where music's playing louder, more uh, bass, treble, whatever it is, tower speakers. This boat does have two tower speakers on the Power Ion um, tower from Harris. You got the overhead lighting up above. Gives a good mood out in the evening. Over here on the right side of the cockpit, you'll see you have your switches for your lights, interior lighting, overhead, exterior, power up, power down for the tower, underwater lights, horn. Got your DTS throttle here from Mercury. This boat is equipped with the raised helm option, so it's kind of nice, so the captain has full visibility of what's going on around him. You have your ski tow mirror there, so you can see a tuber, ski, or whatever you're pulling behind you. Up here in the front of the vessel, you'll see that we have the removable ottoman that seconds as a cooler. That's a really cool feature to have. Just kind of gives you a little extra jump seat there. Flip it up and you have a drain plug in the inside, so when you're done for the day, water and ice can drain out, you just pull your drinks and go. This boat's equipped with the moonlight gray pillow top interior. Uh, really looks good with the sterling gray uh, woven floor that we went with this particular pontoon. Here in the ski locker, plenty of storage space. It's got the black mat down below and keep your fenders in there, too, any of the water toys. Like I said earlier, all the cushions are on self-supporting hinges. That's very nice. Something that Harris does that's pretty cool is if you pay attention here, on the seat bases, they have these little channels where water can run off of the cushions and drain out to the pontoon so you don't have any water build up inside your compartments, keeping most of your stuff pretty dry in there. Coming over here to your side entrance, you do have a port side loading gate. It's very convenient coming up to the dock. People can load from the port side of the pontoon or from the front gate. You got your chase flip up table here. That's kind of a nice feature there. Makes for a little cocktail table, put snacks out. Got two built-in cup holders. Down below is gonna be that second JL subwoofer that I had mentioned earlier. We got the notches here in the um, ends of the loungers. That way you can kind of put your towels and things that you're gonna be accessing pretty, pretty reasonably. So that's just kind of a couple of the options that this uh, Harris Grand Mariner 250 is equipped with. If you're interested about this pontoon or any other pontoon in our inventory, please feel free to contact me at 210-301-2507. Again, my name is Vic LaPlaca here with Marine Max Sail and Ski in San Antonio, Texas. We'll see you out on the water.